glory. It can do incredible things for a human being. If anything, the ultimate template of self-discovery. And that statement certainly held true for the 2014 Memorial Cup champion Edmonton Oil Kings. Off-season was rather short. That's, that's, that's what I would put towards first off. It was really short, but it was very enjoyable. We got to bring the cups around to a lot of places throughout the city, and that, that was a lot of fun. It's pretty crazy. I mean, I think it's still kind of seeing you know, guys, but uh, you know, it was awesome kind of to be around the community, you know, doing events with the cup. And uh, I mean, just being around the cup it was a surreal experience. Just having that around my family and then being able to bring back something from the Memorial Cup is, is definitely the end goal but for that tournament. And I think uh, just looking back at it each and every day, realizing how big of an accomplishment that was. Big accomplishments call for big celebrations. And they did just that. And the parade was definitely the biggest one. So being the, the marshals at the front of the parade, uh, everyone's cheering for you. Everyone's, uh, Kind of so shocked to see the Memorial Cup in Edmonton. Well, personally, I brought it to uh, my mom's school in uh, Wetaskiwin. And all the kids loved that. The teachers, there's a little bit of a presentation, so that was pretty cool. Uh, at a family dinner for one night, which was really good. You know, got the whole family around the trophy, got a bunch of pictures. And Me and uh, Pollock brought it to the uh, zoo to do a uh, the ice bucket challenge as well there. So that was that was pretty fun too. I didn't want to, you know, do a plain one just out of a normal bucket, so I uh, thought uh, I'd ask Paul if we could do it out of the, the Memorial Cup. Thank you for the nomination, Brett. <laughs> Woo! Not, not very many guys get to do it with the Memorial Cup, that's for sure. Well, the symbol of that special moment in Oil Kings history hangs in the rafters. There is one special person the 18-year-old Regina native wanted to relive that moment with. My grandma was in the senior's home just across the street uh, from us, so I took it over there, and I know she was really happy to see it and uh, you know, showed off to all her, uh, all her fellow uh, neighbors there too. So she's had most of the games she can make, and she's uh, you know, been supporting me growing up watching hockey. She's uh, always in the cold drink, so. I think, uh, you know, I kind of owed it to her to bring it back to her and uh, let her have her day with it too. While the celebration time has passed, the life-changing experience lives on. We, we were well bonded as a team and we, a lot of, lot of what we were doing was very professional-like. We were going around as a team so we had to look the part and we had to act the part as well. Uh, going to the games with police escorts was, was definitely a neat experience for every guy. I always want to relive that experience. That was that was the most fun I've ever had in a hockey season. There's nothing more fun than playing in the playoffs and go to the Memorial Cup and, and bring it home. Uh, it makes you even more hungry to want to do that again. For the WHL on Shaw, I'm Dave Dawson.